all narcissists share this one trait. They're always dissatisfied with what they have. They're always discontented or unhappy with something. They always want something more or something else. They're always looking for another option or alternative. They're never happy with what they already have. They never take a moment to stop and appreciate anything they have. They're always thinking about what's next. They're always thinking about what they might be missing out on. They always think there could be a more desirable situation than what they are currently in. They always think there could be something more. They can seem very nervous, sensitive, strange and unpredictable. They can seem energetic, crazy and hyped. They will promote a product or idea intensively, exaggerating its benefits. They're like junkies. They have a compulsive habit and obsessive dependency. They're always trying to gain something. They're always trying to achieve a desired result or outcome. Because of this, they can never feel comfortable. They never feel at peace with themselves. They can never just sit alone to themselves and not do anything. They experience anxiety from the thought that an exciting or interesting event may currently be happening elsewhere. They believe that other people might be having fun while they are not present. Which results in their desire to stay continually connected with what other people are doing. All narcissists share this one trait. They always feel like they are missing out. As though they are not getting validation. Narcissists want people to be envious of them. They want people to desire to have their possessions, qualities or luck. They want people to yearn to possess something that belongs to them. One of the main traits of narcissistic personality disorder is that they want people to envy them. They want people to desire what they have. And the reason for this is because they always feel like they're missing out on something, which leads them to project this feeling onto other people. They always feel like they need to be at a certain place or they need to have a certain possession. They need to stay at the right hotel. They need to have their photo taken at a certain place or on a private yacht. They have to have something that is likely to arouse envy in other people. They want everyone else to feel like they're missing out. Because that's exactly how they feel. But rather than trying to resolve those emotions from within, they choose to project them onto other people. And they will do this by posting pictures on social media or engaging in grandiose delusions. During that moment, they might be temporarily satisfied, but once that experience is over, their feelings of pleasure and happiness fade away. 
they don't even feel grateful for that experience. They don't feel or show an appreciation for what was done or received. Instead, they react like an addict. They become nervous and unable to relax. They're always looking for the next dose. They're always looking for something else to provide them with excitement or euphoria. They require compulsive engagement in rewarding stimuli despite adverse consequences. Narcissists lack order and stability. They act without a purpose or goal. They are often worried and anxious. They are often wary and impatient because they are unoccupied or because they lack interest in their current activity. They always want something. They envy other people. They wonder why they don't have the things that other people have. They're very concerned with what other people are doing, what people have, and why they don't have what they have. They will often feel and show a cruel desire to engage in casual or unconstrained conversational reports about other people. They will try to take away people's hope and expectation in good things or their lives. They will show contempt and a lack of respect. They will be very insulting. They're always distracted by something. They're unable to concentrate because they're preoccupied by something worrying or unpleasant. They're hyperactive. Like children, they will show constantly active and sometimes disruptive behavior. They engage in impulsive actions. They get excited or upset very easily because they need stimulation. There's always something that arouses their interest or enthusiasm. They always need something new. They're always anxious about when they're going to get their next source of validation. They're always afraid that they're going to be missing out on something. Which is why they're always distracted. They're always unable to concentrate. They cannot be present with you. They cannot appreciate anything that they already have. They don't think before they speak. They don't consider the effect that their actions might have on you. Even in the rare case where they do develop some level of awareness of their behaviors, they soon experience frustration or disappointment and then they just get angry all over again. When things don't go their way, they're no longer considerate. They lose that awareness as soon as they don't get what they want. Because narcissists are always worried and restless, lacking order and stability, and making a long and arduous search for something, it can make it very difficult for you if you are in a relationship with them. Because they can never be satisfied. You are constantly trying to make them happy, which causes you to experience worry, nervousness, and unease about anything with an uncertain outcome. You're always anticipating where they might lack interest in the current activity. When they might want something else. You will use up all of your resources and reserves 
in an attempt to catch their attention. You will feel like you are always jumping through hoops. You always have to do things that seem difficult or unnecessary. You have to do a complicated and annoying series of things in order to get or achieve something. You always have to do something to keep them interested. You always have to provide them with a new or unfamiliar thing or experience. You try to dress the way they want you to dress. You try to always find something interesting to say. You feel the need to say something that might evoke admiration. Something that might make the narcissist view you as someone who is deserving of their respect and approval. You might talk about your success or a new opportunity so that they see you as someone they can trust so that they see you as someone they can believe in. They're always nervous, sensitive and unpredictable. They're always thinking about what's next which can cause you to constantly seek out the new shiny thing to keep their attention because they're always looking for something. They're always on their next adventure and they always have to drag you along on whatever they want to do. All narcissists share this one trait. They're always dissatisfied with what they have. They're always unhappy with something. They're always looking for something more. They're always looking for a better option or alternative. They may not always want the same things, but they all share this one trait of always wanting a shiny new toy or experience, which they later don't feel any gratitude or appreciation for. And yet they continue to look for more. They engage in compulsive engagement in rewarding stimuli, despite adverse consequences. It's a cycle that never ends. They always experience feelings of worry, nervousness and unease about something with an uncertain outcome. They always experience strong desire or concern to do something or for something to happen. They have a constant need for validation and stimulation. They never have a reason to change their behaviour. Because they're always around people who make it possible for them to do this. They're always around people to enable this behaviour. So they will always be longing and yearning for something. Because deep down they feel like they're never enough. And it is this reason why you will never be able to have a healthy relationship with a narcissist. Because you just can't be yourself around them and feel like that is enough. You always have to be what they want you to be. You have to dress the way they want you to dress. You always have to talk about something impressive or admirable. And this is also something that they have to deal with because they're never satisfied. They always want more. They're always looking for the next big thing. Rather than the amazing things that are right in front of them. They're always disinterested in whatever they already have. They're always detached. They're always distracted by the thought of missing out on something better or greater. rather than realizing what they already have. You're always trying to figure out how you can get their support or agreement, but they have an inability to be present with you. They're always looking for something new. But rather than jumping through hoops, and holding yourself responsible for their short-lived experiences of happiness. 
let them solve this problem on their own. Narcissists are constantly looking for the next big thing instead of appreciating what they already have they are always looking for something more because they are using the outer world in an attempt to resolve these feelings within themselves when the real issue is that they feel like they're not enough they feel like they need something to complete them and that is why this behavior is never going to change because they never come to the conclusion that the source of validation and stimulation they need should already exist within themselves Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching.narcsurvivor.co.uk Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.